Hey guys, the Chase Dog here, and welcome back to another episode of UFC Free on the channel. That's right, guys. This is our Goat My Career Mode of the Chase Dog, and it is episode number three. That's right, guys. If you don't know what Goat is, it is pretty much we are aiming to become the greatest of all time in the UFC. So guys, if you haven't seen the previous episode, go and check that out. Its link will be in the description down below, and there is a playlist of the UFC Free Goat My Player Career Mode of the Chase Dog on the channel. So go and check that out if you haven't already yet, guys. If you are liking seeing this series on the channel and the game, make sure you hit that like button hard, guys, but not too hard because you will break your computers. Guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join the Dog Squad. And Tick the little bell to become part of the notification dog squad as well. Guys, if you want to follow me on any social medias, go and follow me. I have Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, and Twitch. They're all linked in the description down below. And let's get a minimum of 10 likes on this video right here, right now, right up in your face to show support for the game, the series, and the channel as a whole. But guys, without further ado, we are going to be diving back into where we left off in the last episode. We have successfully won two fights in the UFC. So if you haven't seen the previous episode, guys, we ended up starting in our UFC career. We got out of the, um, I guess you could say, like the indie MMA scene, and now we're in the UFC. Dana White signed us to a five-fight contract. We have won two of those, as you can see over here, right there. We have won two of those. Those were both in the last episode, and of course, that is why we are sitting at 5-0 on our streak. Can our streak continue? Will our streak continue? I'm guessing at number fight number five we fight our rival Young again, which would be interesting because he did sign with the UFC and as you can see our next opponent for our third fight in the UFC has a streak of 12 wins and only two losses. So it's going to be a lot harder and also, I chose him because he was the, like, I guess you could say, he was the most challenging opponent because his overall stats on all four of his things were ten times better than mine. So it's going to be interesting to see how we go, guys. So, of course, we got to do some schedule of our camp. Like, we got to do our camp training. Um, see, if you go to that gym multiple times, then, of course, you're going to get a, um, a discount, I guess you could say. We're at the basic one right now with um, Grey Maynard and all those guys, but if we continue to go up, then top level we can get Faber coaching us. So I want to check what the other ones are. Tony Ferguson at the top level of the... Uh, where does it say the name of the thing? Jiu-Jitsu. Boxer, we have Holloway. Wrestling, Demetrius Johnson. And then Kickboxer is Cruz. Aldo for Jiu-Jitsu. And then Dillashaw for wrestling. Kickboxer Conor McGregor. Ooh. You know, that that's 20k just to get into that gym, though. Is it worth it, though? That's, like, the most expensive one. Like, that's 10k right there. Because, see, my guy, his signature moves are his kicks. They will knock you out. So, I feel like going with Cruz would be a smart option. But, like... I kind of want to throw myself into the deep end and try and get myself towards getting with Conor McGregor, you know. I really would like that. Um, your next opponent. Oh, what? So my next opponent belongs to this gym and I'm unable to train here. Not enough cash to unlock it. Oh, I didn't even realize the membership. I forgot about that. The weekly training cost is that, but the membership, look at that. 480,000 to get a membership at that gym. Jeez. I can get one at the, um... Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm going to be able to afford that. Even if I did get the membership, I'm not going to be able to afford getting a week done there because I only got 500, uh, 5k left after. Yeah. We might have to stick with probably going back to this one, the wrestling one. Um, just because we already have our membership there. We will buy memberships at all of the gyms eventually, hopefully. But I think for the first week, we're going to stick with this gym. So it's only going to cost us 600 So let's go and do it, you know. Gym rewards. What's the rewards? It's a bantamweight. 
top fair favor. So you can get all of those loan rewards. Okay. Oh, okay, so we got we got all that guys done. That's pretty cool. So you have to like unlock them? That's very interesting. Okay, so let's get into our schedule of our training. Let's go for that's gonna cost me 2k. Yep, okay, let's do four weeks. We need those four weeks, guys. We need them, trust me. Especially going under, you know, under overall against the other guy. So, upcoming fight, let's go into our training. Okay, so first we wanna promote it. We wanna do, hand out flies for the gym. He's handing out flies around the city this week for the best gym in town. Spoilers, it's ours. Hey! Okay, what do we want to do? We want to learn something. Ooh, we can work with... We've already done his. Oh, so you can learn stuff from all of them. Ooh. Prospect here to get those ones. So we can learn the Flying Knee, Tie Terror, Wrestling Sweeps and Crushing Presence. We might do that on, like, the next week. I was just looking at that anyway, but that actually looks pretty good. So let's get in and do some training. We need to train. This guy has got a better strength. Like, he's got better striking, grappling, stamina, and health compared to us guys. So if we're not careful, he's going to destroy us. And we don't want that. We want to be able to beat him down without a fight. Okay, so. Uh, we'll do some ab wheel crunches. There we go. Looking good. Okay, so return to the calendar. That's one week done of training. I really do enjoy the training aspect of this. Like, it makes you actually have to use your points wisely. So, what we're going to do is we're going to spend some time streaming first. Playing games on stream tonight. Join me. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now we're going to go on spar. Um, because this week we're going to spar on. So, that gives us a couple of weeks to rest. Um, after, of course, the sparring session. So sparring gives you practice against a training partner who is emulating your up-and-coming opponent. Finish sparring to unlock key to victory. Keep it safe. Okay. Come on, mate. You wanna go, me? You wanna go? Ooh. Close the gap. Ooh, 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 jeez. You know what? You wanna do that? Oh, drilled him. Oh, oh, kidney shot. Oh, he got me. Okay, I got out, I got out. Get off of me. Get in half guard, come on. Oh. Sprawl. What are we doing? Sprawl, come on. We've got 10 seconds to last, <laughs> come on. <gasps> it's not letting me sprawl! He keeps reversing my sprawls. Jeez, okay. Well, we lasted... We lasted it. That was a pretty dominant type of beatdown from that leech dude. But we survived it. So, a two-touch kick. What is that? Best to take the fight... Ah, uh, this fight to the ground. Okay, so... We gotta take the fight to the ground if we obviously want to win against this dude, so... That's not something that my my guys really used to. <laughs> if the JSTOG wanted to connect with his fans, he would fight better. Okay. If that's what you think. Post on social media. Doesn't know what's coming for him. Bang. The kick that we did. Oosh. I'm ready for anything. Hell yes. So we're ready for that Mark guy. So now let's train a bit. We'll do some wrestling 101 because we want to get ready for the floor work. This is going to be one hell of a fight, guys. Trust me. This is going to be a hell of a fight from the Jace Dog. It's going to be my toughest fight. Like, you'd think that the debut would be the toughest. It kind of, leading into it, like, it looked pretty daunting for our guy. But, of course, we've got to learn something this week or we're going to do it in the next one. Um... 
I think week four we're going to learn some moves and perks. So we're going to go and do some more training this week because we did some other stuff. So we're going to learn uh, do some practicing on our ground and pound. We want to do some tap and strike. We want to get ourselves just ready to rumble, you know. Wrestling 101 because we want to get ready for floor work. Sprawl. Shout. Or sprawl and shoot, I mean. And then stair climb to end it. There we go, we're looking very, very good. One more week of training before we head into the huge fight. We are the underdog in this fight, guys. Literally the underdog. So, we're going to have an ice bath. Nothing like an ice bath to fix me right up. And then we're going to go and learn something. We're going to learn with this one. We're going to do this guy's stuff. Okay. This is awesome, guys. I'm really enjoying this. Let's control that backside okay. Now position. Focus on our ground and pound. Okay, so land free strikes from the black uh, from the learned free strikes from the backside mount in 30 seconds. Your training partner might try to transition out. Block it with R2 and the right and low stick. Nice well, he didn't even block it at all. That's the way you break them down, where they can't hit you back. He didn't even block it once. I just hit him with those hits like bang, bang, bang. He's down. Okay, so we got a perk, which is, of course, Crushing Presence. Level number one, Wrestling Sweeps, level two. Let's apply this perk while we can. We're gonna need it. Where is it? There it is. Fitness. Nice, okay. Looking very good. Continuing on. 40 more to spend. We're going to, of course, I think we'll post on social media. It's about to get cold. Brr. Okay, so we're going to post on social media after. Like, we got 10 for that. So we want to use, like, maybe, like, a 10 and a 30, uh, 10 and a 20. So we're going to go Wrestling 101. And... Go the Ab. Ab and Crunches. So Ab Wheel and Crunch. And then Wrestling 101. Okay, nice. That ice buff sounds nasty, but whatever it works to get you better, go for it, says Abby. Nice. Okay, go back to the calendar, and then we want to, of course, tweet out about the fight, because it is literally going to be fight night. Once we tweet it. Or we'll fight week. Doesn't know what's coming. I'm ready for anything. Look at that, just punch and bam! We are ready indeed, guys. It is fight night. Fight the hype has went from very low to low, so we improved it, which is good. Uh, that helped with it all, so... I'm guessing if we just, like, post on social media the whole time, like, all the time, it's gonna probably hype it up ten times more, which we will do in the next fight, I reckon. We're going to go out, we wore our... Um, those one. We wore that one first, and then that one. We're gonna go out in blue. Let's go out in our blue. Okay. Expecting some fireworks from you tonight, Jace Dog. Let's go, Jace Dog. Do work. How bad is the Jace Dog? I think even I could beat him. Well, Cuccio, or Cuccio Carlton, step in the octagon, boy. Here we go. All right, coming up next, it's a UFC. Here we go. Let's go, guys. And well, here an comes the Jace Dog wearing a shirt this time, guys, instead of a jumper. Right now, very interesting We're ready. We are ready to rumble against Mark. Let's do this, guys. Third fight in the UFC. What's the stats? One fight fights in a row by KO. One five of the last five fights by KO is currently undefeated. Undefeated, guys, and our opponent has two losses to his name. Can we give him his his third, or will he give us the first loss? I don't want to lose yet. Not yet. I'm not ready to lose. I'm ready to continue to dominate in the octagon, baby. Okay, here we go. Tail of the tape. So these fighters are just a year apart. He's a year older than me. And a similar I got a better reach, and, and I'm higher than him in height. So that'll be easier to kick in the head. Buff. Here we go. This is going to be an interesting fight. He has better stats than me. But your boy Jace Dog's ready to rumble, ready to continue. Even if I did lose this fight, 
at least I know that I challenged myself. And, of course, we can improve if we do lose, which we hopefully won't. Oh, yeah. The Chase Dog, not Bulldog. <laughs> okay, here's our opponent. From England. Okay, come on. The Crusher. Okay. Interesting. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Ring the bell. Here we go. Are ready to go for round Oosh. one. It's hard not to back to his last appearance. A huge knockout victory for him that set up this particular showcase here tonight. Can he keep the momentum going? Work his way towards that top oh. and register Come on, mate. another knockout. His oh yeah. He is more popular than ever after a big knockout win his last time out. Come on. Come on. Oh, you wanna go me? Beautiful. You wanna go me, mate? You want to kill me? Here we go with round one. You want to kill me? Denying just how much power this fighter has in his kick. So let's see how oh. early he chooses to attack with it. Does he go low to the leg? Does he go high to the head? Let's see how the early portions of this fight Oh, 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 he rocked me there. He's blocking him. Misses a huge hook to the head. Oh, tagged him. And both guys really Ooh. throwing He's definitely starting forward. to get me. Ooh. Oh, roundhouse kick. Good defense there. Oh, he's getting busted up. This one's a lot more harder, guys. Head, but misses. Nice. Under three minutes to go in round one. Oh, a huge block there. Oh, oh rocking up the side of the head. Come on. Oh, come on. Unable to connect with a right. Come on. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Oh, he connects there. Rocking him. Come on. All right, so there's that oh, he kick. got me right in the body. Lands, Joe. This is an opponent who has been subject to body damage in the past. Let's see if he can show up the defense here. Ooh. Beautiful jab. Using his jab effectively here, Joe. And he connects there. Definitely a lot harder, this dude. Oh, there's the head He's 100% a lot harder. Oh, yeah, come on. He split me. Oh, he landed it. And there he swung with a haymaker. Oh, Jacasey gets tagged by that stiff jab. He's got to get that goal. Oh, no. He's got him hurt here. Oh, oh, oh. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. I've got to be careful with this dude, guys. Come on. Stay down, mate. Final seconds. Seven seconds. Got to be careful. Oh, we haven't had a second round in a long time. Ooh. He cut me on my lip. Jeez. That was a lot harder. I can feel how hard it is to verse this guy, guys. It is so much harder against this dude. Like I said, he has more higher stats than me. Look at that hit to his head. It's a lot harder. Ooh, hello. But like I said, guys, it's a lot harder against this guy. He's a lot stronger, a lot faster, and it's just, it's going to be, a, it's going to probably most likely going to go to the judges, and I don't want that to happen. Second round underway. Ooh! This could be it right here. We rocked him. Stamina's low. Well, the offense has been there. He has landed ooh. some good shots. Ooh, 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 really ooh. Stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. 
Well, when you talk to the coaches at FRC Legion there in France, they believe they have a future champion on their hands, and all indications are he is in the best shape of his... Oh! 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 Get out of here, mate. Not today. Not today. I feel like he's going to definitely get me. My stamina is just not there. Nice body kick there. Come on. Really threw everything into that uppercut but fell short. Oh, Jacasey. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, he continues to effectively use his jab here much like Oh, he took my leg. Well, the strike lands, but just not doing a whole lot of damage because his stamina is low. And he's looking for that left. How about that chin? He's tagging him. Tagging. Oh, come on. Lands a punch there, Joe. Very good job. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. Offensive fight, nice come on, come on. The shot there. Well, he's really wow. Oh no! He he's got me. Like Damn it! I was not ready for that type of guy. Big straight shot for the victory. Oh yeah, no! To end this fight, it landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent God damn it. saw it coming, and before he could recover, the referee damn it. stopped the fight. So a huge knockout victory. I was not ready. My my stamina was nowhere near his. No wonder why I was get I was Let's quickly depleted my things. Right on my chin. Damn. Let's damn. We've been defeated. Boom. We've and suffered our out. first ever loss, and it was one that we is. will bounce back from. And in future, I will challenge this tonight. dude that is what again. Be about for some time. He will not get away with this, guys. Now we go the octagon. Bruce Buffer, I went in as the underdog, and I walked out as the loser, unfortunately. Damn. First ever loss. Mark, I'm coming so for you soon, mate. You wait. Once I get better, more wins under my belt, better overall stats, I am coming for that dude. Damn it. God damn it. We're not going to watch him celebrate. Damn, look at all my strikes. I did so many more strikes than he did. And connected so much more. And we were just like beating it out of each other. I should have took him to the ground. I should have. Damn it. Well, we got some earn in some UFC fight. We failed our objective because we didn't win all of our fights by stoppage. And we went down a fair amount in our longevity too. We were like 97 before and now we're at 92 because we lost. Damn. Lost 5,000... Really? We lost 5,000 fans. Well, they weren't loyal then. Shocking that the Jace Dog lost. Hashtag not sorry. Hashtag fight. Disappointing to see the Jace Dog lose. No he will come back stronger. Hashtag MMA. Keep your head up, Jace Dog. Your fans are still here. Hashtag fight. I will. I'll, I'll bounce back from that, guys. Don't worry. Okay, look at that. Somebody's got to win and somebody's got to lose. Just part of the game, Jace Dog. MMA. Okay. It's true. It is true. Someone's got to win. Someone's got to lose. You can't win them all, guys. You can go through undefeated. I have in like previous UFC games went through the career just completely undefeated. It did not work in this one for me. And we hopefully will bounce back. So we are now sitting at five wins, one loss. Damn, I don't want to get more losses under my belt. I don't want to get more losses under my belt. I want to win, win, win. We are going to A, our main goal is to target Young once we get to him and beat him down and go on to hopefully, after we beat him down, move on. I want to go after that mark, dude. I want that mark, guys, so much, guys. Like, if he's there again, I'm not going to take another fight against him because it's stupid. I'm not going to go for someone that has a better overall stats than me. Like, this guy here, we're tied on... I'm beating him in stamina. 
Uh, we're tight on grapple. He's a bit more on striking and health. So Voss. Hatfield's always been there. I might give Hatfield a go. Not because he's got lower stats, but because he's always been on every single list. And then Hudson. Which, we are just his better. We're like, that would just be a romping right there. I feel like that's not really fair. But he's like, f 14 and 3. 9 and 5. And 11 and 2. We'll go for Hatfield because he's been there for so long, waiting patiently for a fight against myself. So, I feel like it's a smart thing to do. So we're going to go against Hatfield. We're definitely... He, he's looking for his 10th win. We're looking for our 6th. We have suffered a loss, unfortunately. But that's the tricks of the trade, guide, uh, guys. And you've got to take some wins and you've got to take some losers. So it just sucks. It just sucks that we had to take a loss. So this one, we're all just... We're focusing on... Okay, so we've got 10% of um, our... Okay, so... Let's schedule it. Let's go four weeks again. We're only going to do two fights in this episode, guys. I might leave it at two fights per episode, because that might just give us enough time to do this, the training, talk while we're doing it, and have some fun. So, two fights per episode. So, of course, this episode was not the way that we wanted it to go. We suffered our first ever loss, which just sucks. But, yeah, guys... It sucks that that had to happen, but the I guess you could say the best thing we can do is bounce back. So we're going to get our fitness better, of course. So we're going to go and promote social media, kind of saying that we're back. No way that Hatfield is training harder than me. This fight is mine, 100%. We're going to get in there and train. We did our little tweet. So now it's time to train our ass off, guys, and get ourselves back and ready to rumble. So we want to work on our stamina more than anything, I think. Our striking and stamina would be good, but our grappling needs to go up as well, because our grappling's pretty low. So we're going to go that one. And then we can only really do that, so we'll do some wrestling. Okay, there we go. So that's one week down. Next week, it's just going to be all about the training. 100% again, because we want to focus on... Um, we go get all three of those up. Very nice. Where's our health one? Is there any helps here? There's no helps. Okay, so how are we going to do the health? Go back to the calendar. And then once we get back to the calendar, promote popularity, fight hype, stream that. There we go. It was awesome times on the stream today. Shout out to all the fans who came by. And that gives us a bit more popularity. And then we're going to go and train a bit. Okay, so... Work on some ground and pound. Because if we go to the ground, I want to be up to pound. And some wrestling. Very nice. That's two weeks down. One more to go. We're not going to spar this week. Because sparring... It doesn't really matter. Like, it just... It, it's, it's good, but it also... It kind of gives you a hint. To how you can get the victory. So, it's okay to do that. I don't think I'm going to make my guy do that at all, to tell you the truth. I just don't feel like it. Um, so, we're going to promote this fight against him. Just get the, the fight hype more and more higher. Playing against the stream. Nice. Okay, so now we want to sprawl. Do some kickboxing. Our stamina and all that have been going up, so that's a plus. We've got a couple of little nagging injuries on our character, on our guy right now, guys. So hopefully those will disappear very soon. We've just been training hard. We want to bounce back hard, guys. We want to go in up to a banger against Hatfield. Like, literally, this is the fourth week. Let's go in and learn some stuff. So we've done that dude. We've done that dude. Let's go and do this one and get this one and over and done with. So he's the third guy that we need to get done. I want to get it done so that we can see what happens after now you do it. I want to focus inside the clinch. Let's really use those names. Okay, so clinching. So, clinch strike. Learned free, well, knees from the Mai Tai. So, land free knees from the uh, in the clinch. L2 and X or L2 and 0 will circle. will throw knees to the body. Okay, let's go. 
done it. We've done it. Very quick. We're ready for him. We are ready to rumble against him. So there we go. That unlocks those things. So there we go. Titera. Let's get that on there now. Get that right there. Throw that sh right in there, guys. Straight in there. And there we go. Let's go back and get ready to rumble. Do a little bit more. we got 60 more points. We're going to promote to social media for the fight. So I'm tuning in. You've got to play... To scout your next opponent. You know what? We will. We'll do that. Streamed it. And then we're going to go and promote it. Which shows, of course, our knee strikes. No way that Hatfield is training harder than me. This fight is mine. 100%. 100% this fight is ours, guys. We have 30 more points to do. Do some... Mm, tap and strike. No contact kickboxing. We'll do no contact kickboxing. Let's get it. Strike speed. All set. Okay, there we go. We are ready for our second fight of the episode, guys. Like I said, two fights per episode is how we're going to go for the time being. So we didn't really do any advertising in the first one. Okay, nice. Let's go in very low because, of course, a lot of people are kind of probably tuned out a bit considering my loss to Mark in the first ep uh, well, not, not the first episode, but the first match of this um, episode. Let's go the Jace Dog. Do work. Hard work is over. The Jace Dog, this is the fun part. I don't want to be mean, but how's the Jace Dog in the UFC? Well, mate, because I've won five matches out of six. Doesn't matter that we suffered a loss, to tell you the truth. Coming we can bounce next. back, and Hatfield, you've been on every single list wanting a fight? Well, today you get that fight. I'm bringing it to Hatfield. We're bouncing back from that loss. Man, is it good to see we had that shocking loss the in the Oxy fight tonight. before this really one. We want to win this fight. No surprise, he's definitely interested, Joe. We've been defeated. We know what we'll defeat tastes like, and we don't tonight. like the bitter Take taste of it. We'll he's won five of the last six fights via fight KO, right. has Scary had six fights in career, has only lost one fight in career. And we don't plan on losing many more fights in our career, guys. That's 100% sure. Opponent, we don't plan on losing any, any more fights because the Jace Dog wants to keep going. Like I said, you know losses are going to happen. It's just the it's just what's going to happen. No one can ever go undefeated and now our kills for a long for time without, threat. of course. You can hold the so undefeated thing. He's a lot younger than me. But like I said, you can't go undefeated forever. So that's why we've taken our first loss. It's good to get over and done with now than when it comes to like when we're holding a championship and we lose and it's just shocking and hurts us hard. But I did choose myself a harder opponent in that one. I regret doing that. I think our character is not at that stage yet to go against those characters, those fighters. But this time, we are bouncing back. We are choosing our fights wisely. Not going to be cocky like we were in the last one, thinking that we were going to carve it up against that dude. Because we got a shocking lesson learned. But here we go. We don't need to see Hatfield stuff. Oh, I'm ready. I'm ready. Come on, Hatfield. You want to go? Let's go. Now he believes he has made the requisite adjustments to regain the momentum and fall back into contention. Ooh, just rocking him. Look at us. Ooh. Ooh, come on, Hatfield. What are you doing? Come on, mate. You wanted to fight against the Jace Dog. You wanted to fight? You wanted to fight against the Jace Dog? Well, you're going to get that fight. Because the Jace Dog is keen, mean, and hungry. So let's see how early... Come on. Come on. Come on, Hatfield. You want to just fight, mate? Or oh, you're going to hold me? Okay. He's in big, big trouble. The left hook hits home. Ushka. I know exactly what he's trying to do. Ooh, ooh, body kick. While the body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body, lands flush. He's gonna have to make some adjustments here moving forward. Well, you gotta admire the effort. He's come on, Hatfield, come on. Still landing, but the gas tank oh, the Ooshka. It's over. On up. Okay, get up. Back up to his feet. 
You want to go, Hatfield? You want to go? I'm hungry. I am hungry as the wolf. Just over two minutes to go, and what has been a furious round Ooh. one. Look at that nasty jab. Oh, he's going to take me down. Get me up. Get me up. Get me out of this position. Ooshka. Oh, rocked him. He rocked me. I rocked him. Come on, Hatfield. You want to go me? You want to go me? You seriously want to go me, mate? Let's go. Let's go, Hatfield. Oh, when you see a cut this nasty, sometimes the doctor comes in and this fight gets stopped. We might not be far from that, Joe. Let's go, Hatfield. You want to go me? You want to go me? I am the Jace Dog, mate. Oh, clipped him with the jab. Able to land there with the straight left. Oh, got to be careful. No stamina. Wow. Big shots. Final seconds around one. Oh, come on. We just survived that round. Jeez, that was a beating. We beat him down a lot. He's got a knockdown. Don't get over aggressive. Keep doing what you're doing. We've put that pressure on him. We are hungry, guys. The fights are going a lot longer now, which is interesting. We're getting a lot tougher opponents. Look for him to go on Ooh. attack early in this round to try to pick up where he left off in the last round. His opponent was dead. I could have had him done if I um Ooh. This could be it right here. Boom! Shin to the dome. Two shots there. Come on, mate. I have barely any stamina. Oh! Oh! Oh, come on. I don't want to lose two ice. You just missed with that huge kick. He's got him hurt here. Oh, come on. He's hurt. Big shot. I'm hurt. He is stunned. Whoa! No! Get up, Jason. Get up. Get up. Oh, come on. Come on. Get out of my way. Yes. We did it. Bounce back barely, but we did it at the end of the day. Got the W no matter how we did it. It was a pretty sloppy ending right there. No stamina. Hoping that he wasn't going to reverse us. But, bang, knocked him down with that last kick right there. And then I was not going to let him get back up because that's what I made the mistake of doing in the first round. I let him get back up on his own accord. I should have just jumped on him and grounded pounded the holy hell out of him. But here we go, just raining him down. They got a little bit sloppy because we barely had any stamina up, but that one knocked him out right there. He took so many headshots, so it wasn't surprising so that he did get knocked out pretty easily. But at the end of the day, bouncing back from a shocking loss, be about this the Jace Dog needed that decision. win badly. Is Look at Hatfield. Damn. Beaten down. He gave me a bit of a beating too, though. Props to Hatfield. He got the fight he wanted, but at the end of the day, the Jace Dog gets the win. Bouncing back from the shocker of a first fight in this episode. That's what we needed to bounce back though. We needed this win. And now we have it. Six and one. Who will be next? We're going to find out guys after this of course. Hell yes. Which I think my rival's the next fight. So he knocked me down once. I knocked him down four times. I landed more significant strikes, uh, strikes and more total strikes. He got a takedown on me. And control. he controlled it for 29 seconds at one point. And I controlled it for 12 seconds. Okay, so very interesting. Knockout finishes, UFC fights, win. Performance bonuses. Oh, we got performance of the night. Followers and earnings. We went down to from 92 to 81 because we did take a bit of a beating. We got 21,000 fans back. 
But like I said, we got to be careful. I don't want to lose too much of my longevity. I want to be able to stay in the UFC for as long as possible. Okay, I think the j Dog could jump into a boxing ring tomorrow and win the title with no hands. Uh, with the hands like that. Right back on track. Congrats, the j Dog. Now it's time for a winning streak. Everyone knows that last flight was a fluke. Yep. Everyone knows that, that loss was a fluke loss. It's fun watching the j Dog do his thing on fight night. Hashtag fight. Yes. Indeed. Like I said, guys... It sucks. It, we, it was like, I guess you could say, we were the underdog in that fight. And now, like I said, it's like, we were underdog in that fight where we suffered that loss. I shouldn't have chosen that fight. I, I was too confident in my character. Didn't really think that, okay, well, maybe I should give my character a little bit more of an easier start. But I wanted to throw myself into the deep end. So our fight offer is against, is it our rival? I think it would be young, wouldn't it? Yes, okay. So our rival, he has better health than me. I have better stamina. We uh, He has better grappling and better striking than me. Okay, so I, I need to work on my striking and my health somehow. So my rival, 9 and 2. I am at 6 and 1. So he's looking to get to 10 wins. I'm looking to go to my 7th. Let's accept that fight because it is going to be UFC Fight Night. 147 we're on the undercard interesting so that is what our next fight will be at the next episode versus young it's going to be interesting of course we've got to schedule our camp training for the next episode guys but hopefully you did enjoy the third episode of ufc free our goat my career mode of the jace dog if you did enjoy it, guys make sure you hit that like button hard but not too hard because you will break your computers guys don't forget to hit the subscribe button to join the dog squad and spread the word of the jace dog to everybody you know tick that little bell as well guys when you're subscribing so you can compile the notification dog squad and you'll be notified every single time i upload a new video to the youtubes or i go live on the channel Make sure you go and follow me on any social medias, guys, that I have. If you haven't already, they are Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, and Twitch. They're all linked in the description down below. And let's get a minimum of 10 likes on this video right here, right now, right up in your face, to show your support for the series, the game, and the channel as a whole. But guys, currently we are sitting at six wins, one loss. We don't plan on getting our second loss from Young. Now, of course, our last fight with Young... It's been four fights since we've had that fight against him. In that time, we've taken three wins and one loss. So that fight that we beat him in, we rocked him so hard. One of those losses is got my name on it, pretty much. I've given him his second loss. He hasn't given me anything besides a win. So we're hopefully going to be going into the next episode, beating our rival, going head to head with Young. Now guys, like I said, this episode, we had a loss and a win. We went in as the underdog and learnt a lesson. Learning Valuable Lessons is the title of this episode, guys, because we realised that we shouldn't have chosen that fight against someone that was a lot better in just every single stat compared to us. We tried, we went to the second round, but got knocked out. We learnt from that, we challenged Hatfield to a fight, and we laid him out barely but we still did it so with that being said guys stay tuned for episode number four it is going to be the showdown rival fight against young and then we'll find out what will happen moving forward with our contract if we'll get signed for more fights more time in the ufc and of course will we get a championship title shot sometime soon i feel like six wins and one loss is a great type of show to Dana like look this guy is on the up and coming give him a shot before he hits 10 wins you know <laughs> because that would probably be awesome so let's go into the next episode guys in the next episode stay tuned for that it'll be up hopefully sometime soon check out all the other sports games and all the other unboxings on the channel and make sure you hit that like button and the subscribe button if you did enjoy this one guys but as always stay awesome the Jace dog is out of here See ya!